Well, across the country, millions of Americans are celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month, and here at NBC News, we are doing the exact same thing. Yes, this week we are bringing you the stories of some of our own journalists, each of them reflecting on their journeys to the United States and the sacrifices they had to make along the way. Take a look. My name is Camila Boehner, and I am from Caracas, Venezuela. My name is Roberto Bolaño, I'm originally from Ecuador. My name is Sofia Burrell, and my family is from Argentina. I came to the United States when I was 17 years old. I landed in New York. It was January 20th, so you can imagine. I'm from Guayaquil. The weather's over 100 degrees, and then when I arrived, there was a snowstorm. It was really hard to adapt. I was born in Buenos Aires, and I lived there till I was three. We were kind of back and forth for a while, um, but then we moved to New Jersey eventually and kind of stayed there. The intention was never to kind of stay. There was always a hope that they'd go back, but things in Argentina kind of got worse and worse. January of 2004, we were robbed at gunpoint at my house while we were all home. My dad was outside, um, the rest of us were inside with my mom. I think that really scared them and I think it was like their time to like know that they had to leave. The biggest thing is, you know, not having any family around. It was really, really difficult for both my parents, not having a support system around. For my mom, trying to see, you know, how she set up a business all by herself. Meanwhile, trying to raise us at the same time. Both my parents worked really, really hard so that, you know, I could kind of do what I wanted in my life. Toda la gente latina. Somos humildes, pero muy, muy trabajadores. My mom in Ecuador, she's an attorney, and my dad, he's an accountant. But when they came to this country, they didn't have a profession, so I learned from my parents the work ethics, how to work harder, how to never give up. Yo creo que esa es la mentalidad del inmigrante. My parents have always taught us that you, can, you can't stop at anything to get whatever you want. And the fact that they moved, I think, kind of showed like that's how they are. As for moving, I don't think they see it as a kind of sacrifice at all. I think they see it as like an opportunity for us to grow. Like I wouldn't be sitting here in this chair being interviewed by you guys um, on Hispanic Heritage Month if it wasn't for them. It's a life lesson more than a sacrifice. Thanks for watching our YouTube channel. Follow today's top stories and breaking news by downloading the NBC News app.